Hello, ladies and gentlemen. This is Prince Macau uh, speaking. Uh, we have a very, very special Royal Rumble for you guys. You guys are going to love it. Uh, it's a long-awaited one. Unfortunately, we couldn't do a full 30 of each. Uh, we might be able to do of one of them later on. Just depends. Um, but yes, we have Mortal Kombat versus Street Fighter. Now, I'm going to go ahead and tell you guys this. If you guys uh, thought I didn't know a lot about anime or some of these other rumbles I've done, I almost hardly know anything about Street Fighter. I don't know if, I guess it went over my head as a kid or something. I just didn't grow up with it. And I know a few of the characters. Of course, I know Ken Masters and Ryu. Um, but most of these guys, I'm in the dark. I've only played Street Fighter a couple times in my whole entire life. Um, as for Mortal Kombat, more familiar with those guys, but there is some new faces that I'm still not familiar with. So just a, uh, a fair warning for you guys uh, ahead of time. So it's going to be 15 versus 15. And let me also tell you guys this. Uh, they will fight e each other. They will turn on each other. Uh, there's no way we can actually have a legit Team Rumble. But that's kind of good at the same time. And I, and this guy right here, I'll tell you about him. Because he was, he was actually one of the most... Um, yeah, that's why. I don't know why his name got blocked out. I looked him up. His name's Akuma from Street Fighter. I don't know anything about this guy. It, it didn't look exactly like him. Uh, but I was so desperate, um, and he was the only one uh, that didn't look exactly like some of the guys I got on here. So I had 14 pretty good ones. Um, this guy was one that sort of looked like it, but I, I went ahead and kept him. So. so he's from Street Fighter. They block. I don't know why they blocked out his name. It's called sensitivity. Got some snowflakes on community creations. That's what it is. Uh, but anyway, no one's going to throw you a shirt, by the way. Woman in the crowd. Uh, but let's go. So we got him. Who else will we have? And some of these guys will surprise you when I picked up. Mortal Kombat. Some of them are going to really surprise you. And another Street Fighter guy. I'm going to try to say some of these names. I know you guys are going to correct me. Balrog? No, I don't know. Um, I'm, I'm rooting for Team Mortal Kombat. You guys can tell me who you're rooting for. But I grew up with Mortal Kombat, so that's that's one of my favorite games. Uh, but I'm not, I'm not big into fighting games because I'm not good at it. I like this game because I can create people and have a good time. Um, and to be honest with you guys, if it wasn't for uh, if it wasn't for my channel, I probably wouldn't get 2K19 or any other of the 2K games. The channel is the only reason I buy this game. Uh, just to let you guys know. Um, so yeah, uh, otherwise I wouldn't I wouldn't have bought this game. I only buy it for you guys. But anyway, still a fan of this game because I can create and have fun. But we're going to go ahead and start it off here. Hopefully some uh, good action here between these uh, these teams. And hopefully we have a good showdown at the end. Wouldn't it be cool if we had like Ryu versus Scorpion or Sub-Zero at the end? That'd be awesome. Or uh, anything really uh, neat matchup would be really cool. Could be another guy from Street Fighter. I just know he, uh, the hashtag was Street Fighter, and the closest I could get was Akuma. Uh, but this guy is the surprise on the Mortal Kombat. I never saw this guy coming. He's the fly dude. The guy with from Armageddon with all the flies around him. The guy that won't take a bath. Uh, and, he, and he just helped um, uh, Team Street Fighter eliminate uh, one of their own. So this is the guy, uh, his name's like Dramon or something like that. Dramon. I don't know. 
But anyway. This guy is also from Street Fighter. Not 100% accurate on this one either, but it's still pretty cool. I, I liked it. I thought it was pretty cool. It's hard to make some of these guys 100% accurate. Uh, it's just you're not given the material to do it sometimes. So uh, I do what I think is good enough. And <clears throat> by the way, guys, all these characters can be found on Community Creations on Xbox One. Make sure you download these people. Show these creators some support because they, um, they would love uh, to get as many downloads as they can. Another Street Fighter character. I, I have seen this guy. <clears throat> my apologies, guys. I'm still getting over my cold. Hopefully, it'll be done by tonight. Well, tomorrow morning. But so far, uh, I've had about four Street Fighter characters. No Mortal, one Mortal Kombat. Here comes another one, Sub-Zero. And two Street Fighter characters have been eliminated in this matchup. So Sub-Zero is here. And like I said, I've seen better Sub-Zeros, but this is a really good one. I like what I... It's still a good one. And Johnny Cage is number seven. So Johnny Cage comes in at number seven. He's one of the, I, I think he's one of the fan favorites on Mortal Kombat. I know I've had some great matches with Johnny Cage uh, over the course of uh, time. I had one of my best matches. If you guys didn't know, I can't stand Shao Kahn. I can't stand him. And my friend used to use him and beat me all the time. So I took Johnny Cage and I beat him. There goes that one guy. And speaking of the devil, and he shall return. Shao Kahn is here can't stand it. As much as I'm rooting for Mortal Kombat, if it comes down to Street Fighter and Shao Kahn, I'm going to pull for Street Fighter. Because I can't stand Shao Kahn. Never have, never will. Never have liked him and never will. And uh -oh, the Mortal Kombat characters, they're getting tossed out now. Johnny Cage is done. Kun Lao's number nine. And there's going to be characters that I, I do not include. Uh, probably from, especially from Mortal Kombat, but from both sides. Just um, don't worry, guys. We're going to have another kind of related thing. Uh, to this kind of rumble so I'll add the rest of them in so don't think I, I forgot about some people because I'm just saving it for another one Ken Masters number 10 pretty familiar with Ken Ryu and Ken that's about all I know and there's another guy I'm pretty familiar with as well oh, well a couple from Street Fighter I, and I'm familiar with the skeleton dude. I think I've used them before in my few times of play in Street Fighter. I need to give it a try. I mean, I got a free, um, and Sub Zero just got eliminated. Um, I got a. Uh, I got games for gold, like Street Fighter 4 or something. I need to check that out, see if I like it. I think I played it once or twice. I mean, in Vega. I'm kind of familiar with this one, too. I mean, it looks familiar. Of course, I've also played, played Tekken. 
and I've also played Virtual Fighter, which I feel like is a ripoff of Street Fighter. And Luke Kane is 12. But my, uh, I actually played Virtual Fighter more than, uh, besides Mortal Kombat, more than all the other ones. Um, I like the Monk. That's my favorite one on Virtual Fighter. I don't know his name, but he's pretty cool. And then, of course, other fighting games I played was Def Jam, Vendetta. I love that one. It's kind of like wrestling a little. And, uh, Liu Kang is done. This dude is really good. I'm impressed by Blanca. I think that's how you pronounce it. I don't care. Uh-oh. Just when I said it. Yup, he's done. He has been eliminated. By Vega. And number 13, this guy came in last minute with me downloading. Uh, I don't know if he's maybe just on one game or two. Uh, uh, but yeah, I went ahead and put him on there. I looked, I looked these guys up to make sure they were actual, you know, Street Fighter characters. So. Shao Kahn's still in it. It's starting to scare me, guys. You guys know I hate Shao Kahn. Can't stand the man. And this guy's from uh, Street Fighter as well. At number 14. He's a big dude. I'm guessing he's a bad guy. He just looks like a bad guy. I don't know the whole story of Street Fighter either. I mean, I got kind of an idea of Mortal Kombat. But I'm not good at those games. That's why I don't... I, I mean, Mortal Kombat, we used to have, like, two controllers and fight each other as, like, kids growing up and where I lived and stuff. But, like, Street Fighter was... Um, and this is the new character from Mortal Kombat, I believe, 11. They already made him, so I don't know anything about that guy. And the Street Fighter character has been eliminated, so it's another one gone. Quan Chi at number 16, very familiar with this guy. He's a pretty messed up dude. Very familiar with him, used him a lot. He's actually one of my favorite people to use. Um, I like the double swords he had on Armageddon. Armageddon was my game. I know it's one, they say it's one of the worst ones, because but it has like so many characters. It, that's why I like it so much. And I, I, I don't know till this day if it has the biggest roster, but it's pretty close of what I've seen. It's pretty close. So. At the time, it had the biggest roster, Armageddon did. Yeah, I, at the time, but I, I don't know after it Mortal Kombat 10 or 11 had a bigger roster? I don't think so. Because there was so many... Of course, 11 as it came out. Yet. Uh, but... Uh, or Mortal Kombat 9 or something? Might have came after Armageddon? I'm not for sure how it all went. But I don't know if any of those had a bigger roster than Armageddon. But Armageddon had some crappy characters too. Um, as well. And then there was a Mortal Kombat versus DC, which eh, it's all it's okay. I like using the Joker. And that was one of the best parts.
Come on, Kung Lao. Let's get rid of Shao Kahn. Oh my goodness, Shao Kahn is Shao done. Yeah. Oh man. You know, if, if Shao Kahn would have won, I would have sniped him. I'm just telling you guys ahead of time. Shao Kahn's uh, uh, brother seems like it's his brother from Street Fighter. Because they're, they're kind of big. Seem like to be jerks. Uh, he's eliminated Zangief or whatever his name is. I don't care. You guys can tell me I'm mispronouncing. I don't care. Zangief. Yeah, Vega and Scorpion. This Vega guy's been in for a while. And I'm starting not to like it. Especially if Scorpion is eliminated. Ugh. Ryu's number 18. Goodness gracious. I, I think I've used Vega. Because I remember that character pretty good. And it's it, he's a pretty cool character. And Ryu, of course, that, that one guy from Mortal Kombat 11 got rid of another one. And Kun Lao, let's see what Kun Lao can do. <laughs> and look at Quan Chi. He's going to eliminate Ryu, so all the main people have already are already through. Right? Baraka, number 19. Baraka is number 19, so we got all Mortal Kombat characters in the ring right now, and it kind of evens out. Hopefully, at the end, it'll even out uh, from Street Fighter and Mortal Kombat. Uh, we'll get, a, like, the hopefully, what I'm hoping is we get a showdown between both um, sides that, in the final two. That's what I'm hoping for, but sometimes it doesn't happen that way. And that new guy's done. Jax is number 20. So now we're getting tons of Mortal Kombat. Jax is number 20. I like Jax. Jax is a fun character. Barack is a fun character. Uh, Kun Lao's fun. I like how it is, he's got like a razor blade hat. All, I like all four of these characters pretty good. It's it's basically people from Mortal Kombat 10. I'm not really familiar with. Or 8 or 9, whatever the other. I think it was 9. Um, and Bison from Street Fighter. You guys had to correct me one time on him. I don't think I knew where he was from. Or some, something I said. Like I said, I'm not familiar with Street Fighter hardly at all. Some of the characters look familiar. Probably played it a couple of times and used those characters like the Vega, the Skull Dude, he looks familiar. Um, a couple of them do. And of course, I've, uh, I've used Gael a couple of times on this channel. And Quan Chi's getting double teamed. see if Quan Chi can survive the double team. His own brothers are betraying him from Mortal Kombat. Yeah, the characters I don't like, I, I can't really say anything about Street Fighter, but the characters I hate from Mortal Kombat is Shane Zoom and, and Shao Kahn. And I, there's a couple other ones I don't like. I don't like Blaze or a, or a, or a the heck? Game got possessed. I think it's because I said I didn't like Shane Zoon and he started doing magic tricks. Yes. I don't care about it. Hey Shane, you stink. Doesn't doesn't change anything. And T-Hawk from uh, Street Fighter. Guy looks familiar too. Kind of looks like the Night Wolf of, of Street Fighter. Oh man, Bison got one. Jax is done. Who 
Who will win is the question. Rain. I'm surprised they made this guy. And I'm surprised I actually chose him over some other famous uh, kind of ninja-like guys on the game. Uh, but I wanted to do something new. And who uses Rain? I mean... Yeah, Rain's here. And T-Hawk with another elimination. And look at the double team on Rain. Will we get a triple team? I don't think so, but I thought we were for a second. Kun Lao's been in for a while. Quan Chi has been in for a while. Oh, Baraka gets pwned by Rain. I am not a fan of Rain in general. <laughs> Um, and that, you know, this character's okay, I guess. I know who's a fan of Rain, though. Luke Bryan. That's who's a fan of Rain. But I'm not a fan of him. Uh, but anyway. Rain is a good thing. Oh, God. Get it out of my head. Kotal Khan's here. I've seen this character before, Kotal Khan. Um... I know he's on one of the Mortal Kombat's I didn't play. I, I need to get Mortal Kombat X. I do. He, I think he's from Mortal Kombat X. I need to get that. Like, I, I don't understand why I haven't gotten it yet. There was one point where it was like five bucks and I still didn't get it. So, I probably, what usually happens is I lose it at these games and then I throw a fit. So that's why I don't get fighting games anymore. Unless I'm playing against somebody with two controllers. The controllers are so pricey. I, I don't get two controllers because it's not worth it. This guy looks very familiar on Street Fighter. And I probably have used this guy. I thought he was from Tekken for a second. But I don't think he is. And Quan Chi. Oh man. T-Hawk's on a roll. He is on a roll. Lau's still alive. I, I'm rooting for Kun Lau. I'd love to see Kun Lau win this. And Noob. No, never mind. I want Noob to win. I love Noob and Smoke. They're one of my favorite characters. On, I like I like them when you can switch them out on the older games. I think it was Mortal Kombat Deception? I've been able to do it on a couple of the other ones, but I remember doing it on Deception, I think. I think on Armageddon there, you can't do it anymore. This t hawk guy is looking impressive. This, is, this has turned out to be a pretty good rumble so far. Hopefully number 30 doesn't win or something. Yeah. Man, how many people we got in there? I think we can only fit about one more. Somebody's going to get eliminated soon. I figure Kun Lao would already. And I'm going to just call this guy Saget. He's from Street Fighter. It could be Kotal Khan. This T-Hawk guy's been on a roll. And Bison. It's going to be Bison. So we are getting down to the nitty gritty in this matchup. I don't know who all is left on the Mortal Kombat team. 
trying to, I, I figure there's another Street Fighter character, I'd say. Um, I haven't really been counting and keeping track of it, but hopefully once we get to 30, we'll know. This T-Hawk guy, they got to get rid of him. He's causing problems. Look at this guy. Is that an elimination or is that just a move? Oh, uh, it's just a move. Oh, no, Kun Lao's done. Oh, uh, and Saga got rained. Oh, man, it's not looking good for Mortal Kombat. Oh, no. And Noob, don't take Noob out. Noob's my boy. Oh, my God, he might take Noob out, too. Oh, my goodness, this dude. Who is this dude? <laughs> Kotal Khan. I think we got one Mortal Kombat. Yeah. There is one I can think of that we have left. Um, yeah. We'll see what happens. I The T-Hawk guy's been very impressive. They need to get some people out. bring somebody down. <laughs> Ken Chi from Mortal Kombat. That's the one I was thinking about. So Ken Chi's here. I'm assuming he's blind. I, 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 I'm not trying to be offensive and stuff, but I'm just assuming that. I don't know a lot about the character, but i that's what I'm assuming. He's got a blindfold on. Maybe he doesn't have eyes. I don't know. I thought he did or something. I don't know. And T-Hawk. Oh, my goodness. T-Hawk. Oh, he survives. And, uh, oh, there goes the one dude. Total Con's out. So, the fate of Mortal Kombat la lays in the hands of Kenshin. We'll see what happens here. Because we're down to four and um, three are Street Fighter. That's what I kind of feared. And Kenshin's just walking backwards. Oh my goodness, if he's stuck in the glitch, I'm going to be so ticked. Somebody needs to get Kenshin out of his moonwalking glitch. There goes Alex. Yeah. Yeah, so much for moonwalking, Kenji. There's only one Michael Jackson. I'm hoping we see a show. I, I hope this guy with the white mask doesn't win. I want to see a showdown between T-Hawk and Kenji. That's what I want to see. I think it'd be a good matchup. This T-Hawk guy's been incredible. If he wins, I'd be okay with it. He's been off the wall. You know what? He almost didn't get downloaded. Ermac, I meant to download him. Somehow he didn't get downloaded because sometimes when you run out of space, um, it tells you you need to delete a few before you download it. But when you delete them, sometimes you think you already downloaded. And that was the case with T-Hawk, but of course... We had to have 15 Street Fighters with Mortal Kombat. It was like 20 all together. So, uh, we'll try to get Ermac on one of those other Rumbles. There's a couple other guys as well. Striker, I think was one. Uh, Triborg. A couple of them uh, didn't make the Rumble. Corrupted Shinnok. Of course, probably some of you all don't like him anyway, so. Uh-oh. No, I want to, oh yes, get him Kenji. I want the guy with the white mask out. He's number 30, get him out of here. Oh, that was a total mess. Uh-oh, oh no. Come on Kenji, survive. Oh my goodness. They're gonna double team him. Street Fighters double team. 
the heck? I thought this wasn't a team based. Oh my goodness, really? Come on, T Hawk. I, I think I'm rooting for him, guys. Now, I'm, there's no way I'm going to root for number 30. I hate when number 30 wins. It's so stupid. Kind of reminds me of someone at work that doesn't do their job, and then the other guy does his complete job, but he doesn't get the credit for it. Yeah. I don't think that's going to happen today. Well, we'll see. Oh, come on. I'm rooting for T-Hawk. He earned it. And he's going to get him on the ropes. I think he could do it. Oh my goodness, he's going to get out of this. There's no way. He's got him. Yep. Oh my goodness, what a performance. What a performance by T-Hawk. Yeah, I'd fall on my knees after that performance too. <laughs> because he went through hell and back and he won that fair and square. And you know what, as much as I wanted Mortal Kombat to win, uh, this guy was incredible. There's no doubt about it, uh, how incredible he was. He deserves the victory for sure. Um, as much as I wanted Mortal Kombat to win, he deserves the victory. Um, what a great rumble that was. And even though he deserves the victory, even though he had an incredible performance tonight, he is not going to WrestleMania. Yeah, I'm not giving you a WrestleMania pass, buddy. You did great. Don't get me wrong. I'd give you a pat on the back. How about that? Or maybe tickets to WrestleMania. Well, wait a second. I can't give you tickets because you're not going to WrestleMania. I tried to tell these guys every week that they're not going to WrestleMania, and they point at that sign still. This is this guy's first match on my channel, and he's pointing at that sign like he's been wrestling here since I first started this channel. Think again, buddy. Uh, but anyway, um, I hope you guys enjoyed the Rumble. Uh, if you're new, make sure to like, comment, and subscribe. This was a milestone doing this Rumble because it has been a long-awaited Royal Rumble for sure. So guys, I hope you enjoyed it. I thought it was one of the best in a while. Uh, T-Hawk was amazing, um, and he deserves it. But he's not going to WrestleMania. That doesn't change. I'll see you guys later.